here today. Not even seeing high clouds starting with a live look from our camera out at the Lewis and Clark Monument. So on the Council Bluff side looking here is I-29, the Epley Airfield and downtown Omaha. Conditions still pretty quiet out there. Visibility good and temperatures ranging from 48 in Red Oak to 62 Maryville and Norfolk. Sitting at 59 here in Omaha with winds still fairly light. Where we're seeing even lighter winds, some cooler temperatures. We are getting a little bit of patchy fog now. Page, Fremont, and Taylor counties out on the Iowa side. Visibility here for the metro, though, still fantastic. 10 miles out of a perfect 10 miles. Wind gusts, though, going to increase as we head throughout the day. Gusts out of the south up to about 20 miles an hour. We'll watch that dry cold front move through when shifting to the northwest this afternoon. Bit gusty here tonight. A live dual pole super Doppler. No, we're not getting any moisture and not expecting to with this cold front moving through. What we will get is that little brief cool down and some increased fire danger. Dog walk today with the breezy winds. Small dog advisory. Beautiful by noon, 79 degrees. Highs today, though, closer to 90. In fact, reaching 90 this afternoon. Forecast high. Beatrice to came of 90, 89 today. Omaha, Lincoln, 84 Norfolk and 88 in Shenandoah. Our latest storm predictor model as we head throughout today will stop here at lunch. Still looking pretty good. Clear skies, but with the winds, I would not recommend the patio uh, lunch here today. For this afternoon, that cold front tries to move through, but not even getting as much as cloudy skies with that. Keeping things clear, cool overnight tonight and more bright sunshine for your Tuesday with cooler temperatures. Today's biggest impact, though, is the increased fire danger. In fact, critical fire conditions out toward our northwest counties. Red flag warning in place starting at 9 today until 8 p.m. tonight. Still looking dry, so not much help there for the drought or fire conditions for the next week at least. Seven-day forecast staying sunny, and though we'll feel like fall tomorrow, 70. Rebounding back to the 80s for much of the rest of the week. Warm and breezy for this upcoming weekend.